to you, Sir Chris Brockman, and to the rest of Patriots Nation, I send my condolences to you and also say to you from the bottom of my heart and with all sincerity, welcome to the rest of us. Welcome back to the uh, rest of us. You think so? Welcome back to the rest of us. Matt Castle won 11 games. Welcome back to the rest. I mean, you can speak that into existence us. all you want. Welcome back to the rest of us. Hear me out. Matt Castle won 11 games. I understand. Didn't make the playoffs that year. Chad Pennington actually did, believe it or not. Because Brett Favre couldn't beat the Dolphins. Okay. Neither could the Patriots this year, too. Uh, again, I just want to put it all in perspective for you. I said the same thing, just in case you think this is any sort of Patriot hate or <laughs> New York <laughs> anger. I mean, I know that's okay. where it's no, coming it's from. No, I it's mean, not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Dude, on, dude, excuse me. The Ex Bills fans, friends that I have excuse are me. doing cartwheels excuse right me. now. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I have hosted Patriots kickoff dinners. I have uh, seen Belichick uh, up close and personal and have come back and, s what a, I mean, I off the air. Totally get on it. On the air, have sung the praises. Robert Kraft and his family have been nothing but generous uh, in any sort of way for the Jimmy Fund, which my brother-in-law is particularly involved in in the New England area. None of, the, uh, none of this comes from that. And to as further proof, I was saying the same thing when Mariano Rivera retired. Okay? To Yankee fans, welcome to the rest of the world. I was saying the same thing. Because Brady, in your world, for the last 20 years, was definitely similar to Mariano Rivera in the Yankee world. Brady, however, won one more championship, I think, if I could figure that out in my head, than Rivera did. Right? So, honestly, it's different. It's going to be different. Doesn't matter if you do acquire Cam Newton by sundown, which all of a sudden is amazing that it's entirely possible, <laughs> and Patriots fans hope it. Bizarre. Man. After Patriots fans have had their fun with the way Cam's dressed and done his business and did his business and Instagram's <laughs> out and all sorts of hieroglyphics that you can't understand if you're can't over the age of 30. Can't understand okay, it. right. Now, now, all of a sudden, hey. Hey, well, come on. Bring come, him in. Come on up. Bring him in. Come on over. Sure, bring him in. <laughs> Teddy Bridgewater, bring him in. Yeah, we'll do it. We're showing it on our YouTube feed, youtube.com slash Rich Eisen Show. Don Bowie, our coordinating producer, putting it up on the screen. The it being Cam Newton's Instagram post of his own today, calling out the Panthers for trying to frame his looking for a trade as it coming from him and not from the Panthers. And we'll put a pin in that for a second. But just hear me out here. It's just not ever going to be the same again well, you're never sure. you're sure. never whoever comes in won't be the extension of belichick that brady's been won't be the person who just calmly stares down the opponent with no time left on the clock and no timeouts left on the clock and marches down the field never will always make the right decision never 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 going to be the same again welcome to the rest of us it won't be as bad as some of the rest of us <laughs> in the AFC East, okay? Because in Bill, you trust now, and the pieces will be there, and a quarterback will come in of considerable talent, one would think, or they'll draft somebody, and you'll take some medicine that you haven't really felt since, like, the year 2000. Been a while. Okay? Been a while. But when it all comes down to it, there will never be another Brady Belichick again in New England and maybe in the NFL. The only thing that comes remotely close to it, we discussed it after the Super Bowl, Andy Reid and Mahomes. Lamar Jackson and John Harbaugh have to stay together another 18 years <laughs> to match the 20 that Belichick and Brady have had together. With all due respect, welcome to the rest of us. I just can't believe 
my son was born into a world where Mookie Betts and Tom Brady don't play for my favorite teams anymore. It's crazy, isn't it? It's crazy. That you're going to be telling – well, I mean, you would have – even if Brady had returned for two, three years. I would still have to have, have, tell, him, have to tell him, Cage but we would have been sitting about. on the couch yeah. together watching Pats games. Welcome to the rest of us. Ugh. I don't like this feeling, man. It's true. It's true, man. And I can't wait to see where Brady decides to come. I, I think the Chargers need him way more than the Buccaneers do. The Buccaneers were, were the ones apparently who came out of the gate strongest, and that might be giving them an inside track on Tom. Los Angeles might be giving the Chargers an inside track on, on Tom also. Bucks pushed their chips to the center of the table, apparently Jim Fossil style, right as soon as the gates opened. Maybe the Chargers did too. We don't know. We don't know. But the Chargers, man, with that new building that I hope will be opened on time and games going on time with all the obvious craziness going on in our world, in the real world. But in the football world, oh, man, do the Chargers need Tom Brady to come out here and say, hey, there's another team in Los Angeles playing in that new building. Hey, everybody. Now, how about this? Patriots visit Chargers. Bucks visit Patriots in the 2020 National Football League season. Uh, dude. Tom and Pewter coming in. Oh, yeah. Crazy training. Creamsicles? LFG. Oh. Might have to buy a creamsicle jersey. <laughs> crazy training it. Oh. How about them apples, huh? Oh, Wait, boy. Crazy train gets retired, right? No. No, no. That's the Patriots What do you mean? Song. That's the Patriots song. That's Tom's song. No, 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 no. That's Tom's song. Tom built Gillette. Again. Tom built that whole Actually, Gillette thing. Actually, Gillette's been around a Obviously, this might be if you ordered one through 100 Things that will not ever be the same again for the New England Patriots based on Brady's decision. Uh, I, I am know, never listening crazy to Crazy Train where, ever where again. Does, where does whether Crazy Train's getting played or not, I'm telling you, man. Well, he ain't shipping out to Boston. He's everything out becomes Boston. so much more interesting <laughs> nice. now. Where does Brady go? How does he look? How does he play? Who does he? Who does he? Who comes with? And then what do the Patriots do without him? This whole conversation when we've just been so bored of the same conversations in our industry of topic bars at the bottom of your screen and split screening and arguing guy on right, guy on left, woman on right, woman on left. Just when the Patriots guy on were right, coming in. Guy on the left, woman in a box in the center trying to keep the peace and these argument shows all of this stuff that we've all done. Certainly on game day morning, bottom of the screen, topic bar of conversation. It's like the chicken or the egg. Who's more important, Brady or Belichick? Who was the one piece that meant the most for the Patriot way, right. Brady or Belichick? Well, yeah. guess what? We're here. about to find out. Next. And even if yeah, – next. Yeah. Next. <laughs> next. Then all the people – I saw you out there. Tom will never do it. He'll never do it. He'll never think of doing it. Barking into their microphone like they're sitting on their throne, knowing everything. And then when it happens, yeah, you know what? I was just, you know, making sure my phone lines light up. All the garbage. We never know. We never know. Guess what? Tom's out. Who's in? What does Belichick do? How does it look? Do they play crazy train? Does Edelman's case for the Hall of Fame get derailed because oh, Tom's not whoa. there? I mean, get ready for the hot takes. I didn't even think of that. They're all new. We're all refreshed in the sports TV world. Who's got, wait, more pressure, Tom or Bill? Oh, so much better than him going back to New England. <laughs> yeah. I'm serious. For this cottage industry? Are you kidding me? Yeah. Well, in that respect, yeah. yes. But for you. For me, it's not great. Because <laughs> it's not going to be the same it's not no great. matter who comes in. It's not great. And welcome to the rest of us. Can we just hit the reset button on 2020? <laughs> I mean.